Crusader Nation. Nation. Today is Monday, February 26th. I'm Sophia. And I'm Bula. Here's Kaylee with the pledge. Please rise for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, liberty, and justice for all. Attention Wonder Committee, our after-school meetings will begin on Tuesday, February 27th. Please plan to meet in Ms. Knox's room, room 109, from 2.30 to 3.30 p.m. on February 27th. The robotics team will meet on Wednesday, February 28th at 2.30 in room 132. Teen Advisory Board meets today from 2.30 to 5 and tomorrow from 2.30 to 5. Don't forget to join us for our Percy Jackson at Barnes & Noble's on Friday, March 2nd from 3 to 5.30. Be sure to sign your team up ahead of time in the Media Center if you want to complete a breakout quest. See Mrs. Minero if you have any questions. The PTSA is sponsoring a STEAM Career Exploration Fair on Saturday, March 3rd from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Meet career professionals who can answer your questions about job responsibilities, requirements, and skills. Learn what education and training is needed after high school for your career. See the posters around the school for more details. And now a special segment for Black History Month. Today we honor Shirley Chisholm, American politician, educator, and author. In 1968, Shirley made history by becoming the first United States African American Congresswoman, representing New York State in the U.S. House of Representatives for seven terms. Chisholm went on to make history yet again, becoming the first African American and second woman to make a bid for the U.S. presidency with a major party when she ran for the Democratic nomination in 1972. In announcing her bid, Chisholm said, I am not the candidate of black America, although I am black and proud. I am not the candidate of the women's movement of this country, although I am a woman and I am equally proud of that. I am the candidate of the people, and my presence before you now symbolizes a new era in American political history. Shirley died on January 1, 2005 at the age of 80, but nearly 11 years later, in November in 2015, she was posthumously awarded the Distinguished Presidential Medal of Freedom. Sophia. And I'm Willa. As, As always, it's, it's a great day to be a crusader. Yeah. yeah.